I think I've got castanitis with the joy that the starting brings. Not finish the older projects, but begin on all new things. But I must resist the starting, I must finish and block. I've got ends to weave, get the needles free. Empty bags I will see, and start again on Christmas Eve. Oi. Okay, so this is a puppy who doesn't like going in the car, doesn't like going to the groomers, doesn't like having a bath, doesn't like having her hair cut. She's having a lovely day. Are you alright, Poppet? There's a good girl. There's a good girl. Well, she's still about as happy as she was, but she smells a lot better. You take you home. Come on then. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hurry. <laughs> so sometimes in the morning she just looks at me like this and I'm really not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, she's looked away now, thank goodness. I was getting a little bit intimidated. The wet hair, deep voice, eyes like holes in the snow podcast. <laughs> I'm recording this downstairs as himself is uh, in bed. I shall not disturb him. Hope you're all okay. Uh, yesterday, had a visit in the morning and another one in the evening and then working in between. So uh, I did say my life isn't very exciting at the moment. Today I have two ceremonies and one of them is a burial. And um, given how the weather is, it's going to be a tad soggy underfoot, I feel. We're in a, a hall, a community hall, for the main part of the service. And then to the graveside, which uh, I said, I'll keep that bit short. <laughs> so I feel that it might be a tad cold, wet and miserable. Um, there, I don't know what it is that I seem to get more burials in the winter. And I know there are more funerals in the winter, but even so, I seem to get more in the winter proportionately than I do in the summer. I do not know why, because I've got another one in a couple of weeks, but never mind. It is, um, it's it's not been nice weather here, we've had quite heavy rain. According to the forecast, it's going to be dry in a couple of hours, so that's good. Um, that's also good because Madam, with shorter hair, will feel the cold a little more than usual. So, um, so hopefully she'll keep cosier and toastier. Uh, knit night tonight. So that will be good. Himself is off to London. He's going for a meal, a Christmas do, with um, some of his former colleagues. So that will be good. They're off to an Italian restaurant of some description. So that will be very nice. And yeah, another day in paradise. Oh, my arm's getting stiff. There we go, that's better. So where are we? It's the, um, the 8th today feeling fairly disorganized about uh christmas i got fairly organized all my um my sort of business related cards were all written before december and the number that have been delivered so far is so i will try and rectify that this week um knowing that everyone's busy there is a dilemma because you want to sort of say hello to people and remind them of your existence and that sort of thing but also folks are busy and there's a pandemic so there's also that sense of uh shall i just stick it through the door because that'd be easier but am i just wanting to stick it through the door because i'm feeling a bit lazy about it i can justify it either way 
Uh, because I had the visit in the evening, I didn't get much crafting done yesterday, but I hope to catch up with that during knit night tonight. Um, yeah, I think that'll well, probably be it. Another short one today. hope that's okay with everyone. And I will be back again tomorrow. I will try to remember to take my camera with me today to give you some footage. Not of the burial. No one needs to see that. But um, just round and about different places. Um, yeah, I will try and do that and show you some of my journeys. So fingers crossed I'll remember to do that along with my change of clothes and shoes because that's possibly no, they're possibly going to be needed today. Oh, that was a very slurred sentence. Sorry, I'm not drunk. It's um, five to eight in the morning, so I'm definitely not drunk. And I don't drink, so I'm definitely not drunk. And she's now curled up in her favourite place. Bless her. Well, I realised I didn't finish things off, so wishing you all a lovely day. Take care. And I will see you again tomorrow. Thanks ever so much for being here. Thanks for all your comments. I'll see you soon. Cheers. Bye.